and today we got Tony Canal with us. Tony, uh, tell me a little bit about what your business is and what your business is called. My business is Prestige Partners Insurance Agency and I'm an independent insurance agent representing multiple companies both national and local to Texas. So my understanding I guess is that a customer could get a quote from you for a whole bunch of companies all at once. That is correct. Great. And how long have you been uh, in that business? Um, I've had my own agency now for two years. Prior to that, I worked for State Farm and other insurance-related companies going back for about 10 years. Oh, wow. That's great. So how did you originally get started in insurance? I, uh, I'm a retired police officer and one of my fellow officers. Uh, his father was my State Farm agent at the time, and he encouraged me to look into the insurance business when I retired from the police department. Oh, that's great. So you're using the people skills you learned as a cop in the insurance game, huh? Yes. Ah, all kidding aside, you're a good guy. All right. So, uh, you know, you've been doing this for a few years now on your own. Um, what's a typical customer like for you? Um, typical customer uh, is looking for coverage they need in their startup business phase, and they're having a difficult time with some of the well-known carriers getting that coverage because they haven't been in business long enough and established a history that they are a good insurable risk and I'm able to go to literally hundreds of companies to find them the coverage that they do need for their business. So it sounds like you're able to solve some of the problems for folks trying to find more of a niche type product, huh? Absolutely. That's great. Um, so, you know, obviously there's a lot of insurance agencies. I see them everywhere. What differentiates you from the competition? Why, why do you think customers select you over uh, somebody else in the business? Most likely for the fact that I'm able to go to literally those hundreds of companies out there to find them the coverage they need at a price they can afford and work with them to get the personalized and customized insurance solution that they're looking for for their business. Gotcha. And uh, this is a question I, I typically ask a lot of uh, small business owners is, uh, you know, what makes a customer come back and use your business again and again? We typically don't look at uh, repeat business, but it is sure. a longevity issue with the customer. Mm -hmm. and, and when you're able to provide them the services and the customer support that they need to effectively manage their business and, and alleviate some of the fears that they have with their insurance, they continue to renew those policies with you. I see. And where, where do you see the insurance business going now that the, the population of the United States is aging and you know there's a lot of baby boomers retiring? Do you think that's going to have any real effect on your business? Um, just this morning I spoke with a couple that have been with a, an agent for over 20 years and they are at the stage where they're looking to retire and they're questioning if they're paying a, a competitive rate now and they're also looking at the fact that they have assets they need to protect and that their insurance coverage may not be protecting those assets to the level that they wish they were protected. Now, that's a good point. So it needs change as uh, people age themselves as well. Absolutely. And if somebody's watching this video, what would be the one thing that you'd really like to make sure that they're going to remember? That no matter what their business is or on the personal line, if, if they've had difficulty with obtaining insurance, feel that they don't understand the insurance and would like to be educated about the insurance, with my market capabilities, I'm able to help anybody with any situation obtain the coverage that they need. That's great. Well, I certainly appreciate you uh, answering the questions for us today, Tony and um, wish you best of luck.